good is it to see Allison back on the floor after the game? <laughs> it's great. I mean, we um, we really struggle without her out there, not only the, her ability to shoot the ball, but she brings a lot of energy. She's athletic. She can defend. So to have her back is, is very nice. And, um, you know, after being out for five or six days, seven days, and coming in and performing like that, it's pretty special. Uh, how is Kelly? I know she came back, but had that break in the face there. So. Yeah, she got hit in the face. And, um, you know, it's a physical game. I mean, it's a physical game, and you get hit. And she bounced back and shook it off and came back in and did a great job, made some free throws down the stretch. And um, she knows that's her job, and she did it. We're figuring it out. I feel like it's a slow process and a tough process, but we're figuring it out. I thought the first half we took some some bad shots. We probably took five or six bad shots and um, allowed them to to well get in the game and take the lead. And um, so in the second half, we settled down. We we pressured a little bit more. Kind of got them sped up. In turn, we sped up, which helped us offensively. We were able to get downhill, um, get some open shots for our shooters. And then when they when when we're hitting threes, then they got to pay attention. Then we could get it to Mary. And I think Mary. Mary ended up with 18 points, so that's the way we try to play. What's kind of been the difference you know, between Thursday night and kind of the first part? <clears throat> I, just experience. I mean, we have, you know, Mary Dunn playing almost 30 minutes as a freshman. Morgan Brunner playing 35 minutes as a freshman. Um, you know, those those guys getting a lot of minutes. Um, just every time they play, they, they get more experience and handle handle whatever's going out on the court better. And offensively, we are executing a little better. And defensively, they're in better position. So um, you know, it's just all about experience. Obviously, winning winning on Thursday kind of helped today. They help Monday. Is that kind of well, hopefully, our confidence is building. Uh, that's two in a row. And and you know, at Northern Kentucky, it's it's. <laughs> You know, an overtime game where we had a chance to win it, so easily could be three in a row for for a young group. I mean, they're gaining confidence, and uh, I think we do a really we've done a really good job of taking care of the basketball. I mean, 16 assists to only eight turnovers. It's it's uh, you know that's that's a good game for us. Rebounding is still a challenge. I mean, we have to do better on the boards, um, but you know it's something we work on every day. So hopefully we can uh, we can do a better job Monday. <clears throat> it is easier to give them fewer things to think about. The more you give them, it, it kind of uh, makes it tougher on them. But like I said, I mean, they're getting better. They're, they're on all, in all aspects. And rebounding is something that you know we've worked on since summer. So we're just going to try to, I don't think we're super long or athletic, so it can be tougher. But we also don't necessarily do a great job of boxing out every single time, which we have to do it in, in order to, to at least Shrink that margin. Oh, because they're so young, are you, are you coached with possession by possession almost? <clears throat> you can't do that, but yeah. Like Sometimes I feel like that is the case. Uh, almost when you get two steps ahead, you know they 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 want to do the third step instead of the first step. So we we are trying to keep it pretty simple and um, just be good at the basics. For her, I think a big part of it is confidence. I mean, when you're when you're not getting playing time at all, you know, not playing in some games, your confidence goes down. And the thing with her is, she got her opportunity and made the most of it. Um, she she plays solid defense and knows where to be for the most part, and she makes open shots. And that's what our offense is based on. If you can make open shots, now that opens up our inside game and and just makes it a lot harder to guard. Well, the second quarter, uh, they s went small. And it's really hard for Mary Dunn to defend a smaller player. And so we had matchup problems the, the, the second quarter. Um, and that's kind of when they made the run. And again, with them 
you know, doing a good job. I mean, they, they did a good job of that, and they're making shots, and then in turn we were missing shots, so it was kind of a double, double whammy for us. But, um, and then in the second half, <clears throat> we were able to uh, pressure a little bit more, um, try to get them sped up a little bit more. They missed some, some close shots, some shots that they normally make, and, and then we were pushing more on offense, which um, helped us get some of our open looks that we had. Obviously. I feel like we're playing good halves. <laughs> you know, like the last game we we played a good second half. This game we played a good I think we played a good first quarter and fourth quarter last game. This 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 one was well, we played a really a good third quarter, played a decent half of the first quarter and the fourth was kind of a wash cuz they were pressing and trapping and fouling and and we were we were kind of up pressing too, so with a young team, that happens. You get your ups and downs, and we're just trying to um, level things out. Play a solid. Doesn't have to be great, you know. Just a solid four quarter, four quarters.